What's up, everybody? Do -do -do -do, crypto muscle. Do -do -do, pumping iron and pumping crypto. Do -do -do -do, coming to you with another YouTube video. And all I gotta say is, it's great to be on this side of winning. Because I watch all those losers out there in YouTube land and more. You know, betting on stupid ass shit coins, me memes, and all that. Come on, people. Guys gotta wake up. But. Before I dive into any further, let's look at the exclusive Coco Muscle. I've taken over Coco's Coco. It's going to be Coco Muscle. The Crypto Muscle Muscle Cast. Courtesy of Coco Muscle. Alright? And so, I know, it's Coco Scope. Alright. But, just wanted to put it out there. Uh, I'll probably be doing another Muscle Cast uh, filming tonight. And uh, depending on how late it is, I'll probably most likely post it tomorrow. Because I usually do it late night. And I'll post it tomorrow. Uh, you know, just the latest things going on in, in the muscle cast uh, podcast world that I do. One hour exclusive, unchained, unfiltered, unadulterated, un everything. All right. I'll play music. Which, by the way, I think I'm a better. I could, I'm better DJing than crypto music, all right? Just saying. I mean, the music I put out there, I could I DJ him any day, man. Plus, I got the muscles and peaks. I mean, I win in crypto. I mean, I got the complete package here. Just saying. So, I got a nice song I'm going to use for the next muscle cast. So, I'm looking at these two, you know. This is, uh, this is the aftermath of my YouTube channel taken down right here. The OG channel. And then put one out last week. And then I think I diluted <laughs> this episode when I put out the year two anthology. You know, being two years in YouTube. So that's what that is. Kind of diluted the two. But it's alright. You know, that's what it's all about. It's all about just, you know, checking out everything I got. I got history in here. This is stuff I posted on YouTube on my OG channel. Alright. So just got, you know, I got those there. And let's go uh, take a look at what I wanted to talk about. You know, this shitcoin. I know I'm not talking about shitcoins, but I just wanted to throw this out there. All right, before I get into what I really want to talk about. And it's basically the popper, the proper closure of the death of passive platforms. All right. So that's what I want to do. I want to do the death of passive platforms. And look at this. This. One last thing about this for today, because I've already done a video about this. Dollar cost average, all that stupid bullshit strategies. Oh, you dollar cost average, because then, but you know, when it goes back up, you even out, and you all have more, and you can sell. For, right? It's stupid. Dollar cost averaging is stupid. When you guys say things like, "Oh, you sell it at a loss," you know why people sell it in a quote-unquote loss? Because this shit may not ever go back up. So it's better to sell it out now than sell it out what is nothing. Here's a case in point. I held on to Crystal Token, right? That shitty ass token these last couple of years, right? And I never sold it, right? And uh, the price never went up after ICO, right? Back from the 2018 ICO. And case in point. I never sold, so did I lose? Because it's gone now. So, I'm just saying, <laughs> sell now because the loss is going to get bigger. Would you rather sell now and still get some money out of it? Or sell it when it's down to a dollar? Or perhaps zero when Tech Lee says, I'm pulling the plug on this thing. Because that's, that's when it will become zero. So listen to all those YouTube idiots out there and say, Hold on to it till next year. Because next year, there isn't going to be any million token. Just saying, all right? So let's talk about uh, some death of passive platforms, all right? So let's see here. Uh, this is a an honorable mention right here, courtesy of Battalion, all right? I always like to throw this out there because it's fun. Yeah, you know, this is over a year and a half ago from Battalion. <laughs> the site's still up like this. If you go on their site, this is what it tells you. It's pretty funny. Um, 
let's keep it going and flowing here. Look at this one. Mine cow. You guys remember this one? Back in April, they were on the last of issuing, they had a deadline of issuing like refunds or whatever like that for, you know, people that are trying to claim it. And I kept bagging on this thing about, you know, purgatory period. If you want to pull out your funds, you got to wait like six weeks and all that stuff. And what if it doesn't come back? You just never know. And all this stuff. I kept bagging on this thing. This was a shitty platform anyways to begin with. But no, you got those dumb Mark ass YouTubers like Fruit Boy and all the other bloods that go to these type of platforms. You know, they go into it. And then what happens? You guys don't listen. All right, when I talk about passive income platforms, and I pick certain ones, and a lot of times I pick certain ones, they're winners, right? Look at that. So I never went into my account. And yeah, I did go into Battalion. I evened out on it. So, oh man, you know, cry me a river. All right, here's uh, Nexus Global. So I wanted to, um, I guess, say that I bid farewell to Nexus Global, right? This is the one from Jamie at Best Passive Income. Income. You know, was putting out there, talking about, oh, this is uh, Nexus Global, this, and uh, going to Forks Explosion, and, uh, you know, and this and that and this, and, oh, uh, yeah, it's just continuing to do its thing, and blah, 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 blah. And, and then he stopped talking about it. And I was the only one that kept talking about this because I was stuck in this two-year contract. And by the way, I showed you guys uh, a video where I actually finally concluded the deal and uh, I was like surprised that it actually lasted that long and concluded and got out. But now the site's gone. No more Nexus Global. All right. It was garbage anyways. Two years on a Forex explosion. Come on, man. Get out of here with that crap. So that's the end of this garbage. So Battalion's long been over. My capital's over. Uh, I wanted to give a bit farewell to Nexus Global now. This is next, uh, coming soon. This is going to be coming real soon. Passive expert. And you know what's funny? Because you got idiots like, uh, what's his name? Crypto Clover. All right. He's, uh, he, he doesn't even look at these things. All right. He's like, yeah, you know, um, you know, I'm, I'm in, you know, some platforms and passive expert is still doing great and blah, blah. Dude, have you even logged into passive expert? Because passive expert has long said that they're done with what they're doing. Not enough money's coming in. But in good faith, they're allowing people to withdraw and pull out money and all that. And if you're able to do this part right here about this emergency withdrawal, but it all depends on if uh, you qualify for that. And if you do, then you can just do emergency withdrawal and they give you a refund. If not, you just got to just pull whenever a balance is available. So Clover, wake up, idiot. Um... This thing has long, it's going to be, it's dying, all right? It's just, it's already on its deathbed. It's just a matter of time when they're just going to completely stop paying. They're just giving out their money back to people in good faith, which, by the way, is pretty cool. But at the same time, it's not doing great like you said it is because he's not obviously looking at these platforms. So, so I'm going to be bidding farewell to Passive Expert really, really soon. All right, when that last, uh... <laughs> Withdrawal comes. That's what I'll do. And so, let's see here. Let's keep it moving. All right. Keep it moving. Game over. That's all I got to say for these losers out there in YouTube land. All these mark ass YouTubers saying, oh, you know, it's going to go to the moon. Like this one right here. This thing is drawing down, guys. Uh, I didn't get to talk about this in the last video, but it's drawing down. Don't be stuck holding the bag. So, so people, if you have a shitload of this and you sell it now, is it a loss? Come on. All right. Wake up. Because if you don't sell and this thing goes to zero, then your loss is you got nothing and you're holding on to worthless tokens. That's why you just get rid of it now while there's still liquidity, right? This thing's going down, right? This was well over 300. Now it's, it's falling. It's getting closer to falling under 300 real soon just saying and one thing that you know fruit boy exposed about these guys is that guys like this idiot this dumbass money mike dude you know he's a bitch ass mark all right 
talking about he didn't know these features were staked in the con it was put in the contract, such as the burn uh, 20% fees and dumbass stuff like, oh, I'm still fi I'm still applying for Coin Market Cap. I'm applying for these ex different exchanges, and everybody keeps asking, hey, what's going on? How come we haven't heard anything? I haven't heard back from them, or uh, they need this, this, and this, and a bunch of just keep pushing it off, pushing it off, pushing it off. When you're just so full of shit, all right? Because why can't someone like all these other, like the Kirby's, like shit coins like Kirby's and shit coins like Million Token can be put on exchanges so quickly because this dude doesn't freaking care. And you guys are stupid, but you guys don't listen. So just saying, all right? And uh, let's see, what else can I put a death blow to here? Uh, well, this Impulse X garbage. All right. Yeah, you got idiots like that crypto project dude talking about give it a chance, guys. Give it a chance, guys. And what happened was they pay. They changed the way they wanted to pay out. Right. You Impulse X is like my trade, my passive trades from last year. Right. This garbage. Um. Basically, this garbage changed their way of going about things, right? Before you could, you know, make, it says back then you used to say 2.5% weekly, right? And it says up to 5% weekly profit now. Um, but yeah, it was capped off about 10% a month, right? Which is nothing, it's garbage. But no, bloods are in this thing because they're stupid, <laughs> all right? Sorry, but not sorry. And uh, they go into this thing, right? And they change the way they pay out, right? You used to be able to, Make your profit with the impulse passive system, right? And you could, you could uh, cash it out in ETH or Litecoin or Tron, whatever it is, right? But they changed it. So now instead of just doing that, you could pull it out in this shitcoin, Impulse X, right? They said, oh, we're going to pay you out Impulse X. And they put a, 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 a value to it. So people, when they withdraw, after they sell it on the exchange, you know, they sell it for a hundred dollars, right? On the exchange. And then in actuality, money wise, they're only getting like 40 bucks and $30 and things like that from a hundred dollar impulse X token. Cause that's where they, uh, you know, put a point price to. And so people are getting screwed on this thing. It's just funny, you know? Um, there is no flexibility in withdrawals now because it's all done in IPX, right? Before you could, you could be able to convert to all this, event, convert to ERK, all this stuff, right? And so, yeah, they changed the game because obviously nobody cares about Impulse X and it's garbage. But no, you got guys like Crypto, what's his name, Project Dude, where you can't even understand his accent because he just, he talks like this. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. You know, I got like seven million of these. And I was like, what the hell? You, I can't even hear what the hell you're talking about, dude. You know, and shit like that. And that's why he's a shitty ass YouTuber. And so, um, but his dumb ass buys up, you know, he says he has like millions of these impulse hacks. And and uh, he's he's just like one of those idiot believers, like the marks, like Kiwis and the Crypto Mitch bitch and you know Crypto West and Maddies and all those other garbage uh, fruit tubers out there, bloods that bleed all day long. You know they believe, they believe, they believe, and I believe, 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 believe. Come on, people, you guys gotta wake up. All right, so I just wanted to put a, a, a exclamation point on some of these platforms. Point out some things about some of these other tokens because believing and selling at a loss and all that can only, I mean, believing can only get you so far. Selling at a loss is better than selling at zero, all right? Or at, uh, sh you know, shit toshis, right? Uh, I would do it at a loss all day long than selling it at some, you know, at zero when Tech Lead decides to pull the plug on that project or all these other shit coins tank to zero. And like I said, case in point, Crystal Token, they're not even around. And I held on to that. So just saying, don't listen to these dumbasses out there. And when it tanks, it tanks. They're not coming back. It's done. All right. So this is just a public service announcement. 
Comment down below. This is like a part two from the first one. All right, and I'll see you in the next one.